Hey there, and welcome to the testing rails with RSpec tutorial. The goal of this course is to teach you the fundamentals of testing rails applications and provide you an in-depth knowledge of RSpec. RSpec is a popular testing framework for rails. Although not the default testing framework, in my experience, RSpec is actually more widely used. I've worked on many rails applications and the majority have used RSpec. My name's Tom and I've been a Ruby on Rails developer for over 10 years. I've been a Rails freelancer, worked for startups and written code for large global companies. I've also used my skills to build solo projects, including PR Scheduler and Commit Check, both of which have hundreds of users. Two years ago, I began publishing a series of YouTube videos about building APIs in Rails. The series was very popular, having over 100,000 views so far. Now, in this course, I'm focusing on testing. Who should take this course? For those new to Rails, perhaps looking for their first job, this course will give you an understanding of RSpec and test-driven development, or TDD, a key skill for getting hired. For those already experienced with RSpec and TDD, this course will take you to an advanced level giving you the ability to write tests at a senior engineer or tech lead level. For a CTO or manager, this course will provide your engineers with the skills required to write robust, well-tested code, increasing your speed of change and reducing your bug count. Later on in this course, I'll explain the differences between RSpec and other Ruby testing frameworks. As I said earlier, RSpec is one of, if not, the most popular Rails testing framework. And that is reason enough to learn it. Also, this course will teach you the fundamentals of testing within Rails. These principles can be applied to any testing framework. So what does this course cover? I'll walk you through installing RSpec, the basic syntax using the latest RSpec version three, how to test models, how to test controllers, that's covering both unit and inter uh, integration style tests, how to test views. We'll also cover more specific use cases, such as testing mailers, background, jo jo uh, background jobs, and action cable, all using the latest Rails version seven. You'll learn how to test JSON API endpoints, how to write integration tests, and much, much more. I hope that sounds interesting to you and that you will join me on this course. Check out the description below for links to the text version of this tutorial and the mailing list for keeping up to date with new course material. Bye for now and I hope to see you in the next video.